All right, let's see what this radio message is like. Queen Mara, I hail you now out of necessity of the heart. Else I feel as though I will burst into solar flame. Long have I admired you from afar. Ever since you graced me with your power and benevolence in the Reef Wars. Not a day goes by without me thinking back to the time you made me repay that debt to you. How we spent hours together, long into the night. Hey, yo. Would that you spirit me to your side again, to serve as your consul, your knight, your humble vessel, anything to be near you. I beg you to grant me an audience <laughs> once more. Please give me the gift and the privilege of basking in your favor. For without you, I shall wither and crumble into dust to be scattered across the cosmic winds. This again? <laughs> You and I both know he sounds nothing like that, Riven. <laughs> <laughs> that was Riven the entire time. <laughs> oh, I should have known from the Riven well, picture on the thing, but I just thought it was his generic photo. Intimately familiar. How about... Do not speak her name. Oh. As you wish. Oh, Majesty. Sure, Okay, that was the best part of the entire weekly story. Because I was about to be like, Shax is simping hard. But then it's, it was just Riven messing with Mara. Uh, this is the kind of stuff I love. That made this entire like story week just irrelevant. That was fucking incredible. 